to Taipei. So we currently arrived in Taipei. We have a 10 hour layover here. So we decided to go out and take a private tour to utilize our layover because it's 10 hours. It's quite long. So I think we have enough time to see a little bit of the city. So we are just waiting for our driver slash tour guide to come pick us up here at the airport. And then from there, we're gonna go around some famous spots here in Taipei. I'm so excited. We are currently just waiting for our driver to arrive. It's 5.42 a.m. and he arrives at 7 a.m. So it's quite a bit of a wait. So we're just waiting here in the waiting area at the airport. On this layover tour, we have five things in our itinerary. Taipei 101, Longshan Temple, Historical Preservation Block, Chiang Kai-shek Memorial Hall, and eat at a local restaurant. So our tour guide dropped us off at like a place here and then we're gonna walk to Taipei 101 to just take a photo. Fortunately, we went at a bad day. It's currently a little bit drizzling, but it is what it is. We still have to enjoy Taipei no matter the weather. if you can see but that's the Taipei 101 we are trying to cross the road to get there we decided not to go inside the tower as we had very limited time and we still wanted to see other sites we chose to just take photos from this location Unfortunately, I think we can only see the half because it's covered by the clouds there, but that's it. This is Taipei. And now we're heading back to the car. All right. Yeah, do you see anything? Yeah, we got pictures. <laughs> And as soon as we got back in the car, of course, the top of the tower decided to show itself. What is this? This is a Chinese, when Chinese, uh, before Japanese, what's Chinese? I claim Jennifer Lopez is my, <laughs> my wife. You say this one was Japanese? Governor's office. Before? Uh, from a uh, beauty in 1919, over 100 years ago. When was this built? About 270 years ago. And they preserved it like this, or has this been renovated? In the beginning, it's a small one, and it's been, it's been bigger. Mm -hmm. Now we just uh, finished Chinese New Year, so that's uh, for Lantern Festival. Ah, that those yellow balls? Yeah, and uh, this one. The, like this dragon yeah. here? Is that yeah. the dragon? Yeah, lion. Lion? Okay. 
You can see dragons inside. In here, our tour guide Willie was saying that we could pass through for good luck, so that's what we did. He was also showing us how intricate the carvings are in this temple. like 200 some years ago oh the structure of holy roof they don't use any single nail what how do they keep it together they in black in black together really yeah. see see the structure over there just like a suspension to hold the roof. I see it. We pray. We have some important thing to ask, want to know about the future. We need some instruction or advice. For example, if uh, somebody to uh, call you that uh, you offer twice the salary, yeah, and then you need to move to US. Okay, Just and you're not uh, sure if you want to take it. You ask for gut opinion. Introduce first your name, your birthday, where you live. Your, your name, your birthday, and, and where, where you, you live. live. And uh, what do you want to ask? Like a question. Question, yes. Uh, uh, By yes say, or no. Yes or no. You say, uh, should I go to New York to take the, take the new offer? Two, two sides up means... Your question is not clear or maybe. Two sides up like that? Yeah. Okay. Two sides down means no. Okay. One up, one down means yes. Oh. Okay. One up, one down means one yin, one yang. Right. Yin and yang. Yin okay. and yang means uh, one man, one woman, or dark or bright, negative, positive. Yes, in a row. That uh, this says uh, number two. two. Okay, follow me. Yeah, totally 100. Yeah. We get number we two. We got number two. And a little tank. Like a fortune cookie. I completely forgot his translation for this paper, but this is like their fortune cookie, where if you don't get clear answers to your question, you can get one of these instead. So I just, my name, my birthday, and then where I live, yeah. and then my question, and then yeah. I just do this and throw it? Yeah. Okay. No, maybe. What is that? Is that a maybe? Yes. It's a maybe. So it's you a can... maybe? Yeah, maybe means that, that your question is not, not clear. clear. You just uh, ask it again. Or maybe means that the God no. is smiling. No. Try again. Yeah. Show you, uh, you try to repeat the question again. <laughs> Yes. Oh. Yeah. That's a yes. No. It's a no. <laughs> uh, mixed with uh, Taoism and the Buddhism. Okay. Because the Buddhism was uh, from India, but introduced to China 2,000 years ago. After 2,000 years, it's all already blended into Taoism. Taoism is from China. So right. the two 
religion uh, mixed together. So this is the Buddhism temple. What is this one? What is this? It's an uh, incense, incense, oh, incense burner. burner. Before that, uh, people can carry incense right here, as many of you want. But here, Taipei is air pollution control. Only can burn one incense by oh. the temple. So before the incense burner was here, so here the food smoke burn. And uh, you can see the, all the decorations here. This is the Buddhism temple. Can people enter here? Uh, only authorized the people. Okay. Do people get married here or? No. No. No, only for the pray or religious activities. So this is Taoism. And this, oh, this is Buddhism. The this Buddhism, is this is Taoism. All yes, yes. oh, right, I remember that. It's a god of in charge of the exam and the study. You want to get in a good university, you pray you here. You pray here. Or you want to pass a very important examination, yeah. you pray here. This uh, is a immortal of uh, medication because uh, he was a uh, uh, doctor 2000 uh. years ago in China. So for healing. But yes. Is it the same guy? Yes, yes. And uh, you see the lamp of the tower. Uh, every Chinese New Year, before Chinese New Year, people will here donate about twenty dollar each family member to pray next year New Year be blessed. So mm. people's name will on it each step. Oh, on each of those. Yes, yeah, yeah. Here, here you can. Also here you see ah, well, little names and the ad address. Oh, these are the people who donated. I see. And Taoism just like a general hospital. Every people in life will go to hospital. You will need to see a specific department. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's the same it's in kind of Taoism. Like, yeah. Kind like for medical. Uh, advice right. or consult or uh, uh, treatment. This is uh, we call Mazu. Is one of the most popular goddess. Is it that Taiwan. that? Yes. Picture? She is the goddess in charge of the ocean, of the sea, mm -hmm. because uh, Taiwan is an island. Needs a lot of travel by ship. Right. So need her protection. This is the goddess of the sea. These are all donations every Chinese New Year. Goddess of Pregnancy. This is a Taoism about uh, uh, heaven and earth and the water. Because uh, China is a country for farming, grow lots of uh, rice like the Philippines. Yeah. So we need the, the protection of uh, weather. For good soil. Yes, yes, yes. And uh, here is the his name is Guan Yu. He was a uh, general two thousand years ago in China. He's a representative for service and loyalty. Okay. And so every Taiwan police station has uh, his uh, little statue in police office. Okay. Of him? Protect, uh, What's his name? Guan Yu. Guan Yu. Yes. He is the representative for justice and loyalty. Ah, mm. oh, for love. Uh, what's yeah. what's his name? Yu Xia Lao Ren means the 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 old man under the underneath the moon. Oh, matchmaking. We are at Longshan Temple. Still a bit drizzling. It's not really that wet, so so good. You can see so many people praying here. asking questions. After Longshan Temple, Willie brought us to a popular cafe in Taipei, which is kind of the equivalent of Starbucks in terms of popularity. They have cakes even. Look at that. Look at this. Look at this big. It's so cute. There's also a bread shop. What? 
This looks good. Yeah, this one floss. We're getting a hot dog. We're getting pork floss. Do you want anything? Let me know what you want. Thank you. What is this one? Bread inside. Red bean. Red bean. Okay. And this I, one is. If you don't drink milk, I recommend you yogurt. Okay. Yogurt, yogurt is good. Yeah. yeah here, the, I'll, I'll is, uh, oh, yogurt. What is the verdict? Is it good? You can try it. It's a hot dog. Thank you. This is what? This is Zhengzhou. This is Oh, yogurt. That's the yogurt. Okay. Thank you. Where are we headed now? <laughs> oh, we go to a historical preservation block. It's a trading company about 200 years ago. Yeah. Now it's a, the property of the city hall. It's for public purposes. It's Bopiliao historic yeah. block. Oh, it's all made of bricks. Yeah. young people to do their exhibition mm. of uh, artifacts like a graduate show mm -hmm. yeah. some of them will try to rent to young men to be their own shop to sell some souvenirs here we just uh, we do that with the original material and like this, to let people see how people's life 200 years ago. And the space is ready for rent. Mm -hmm. Maybe young people can run a little shop to mm -hmm. sell something. And then here is the bricks, the original. So this is where people used to live? Like, right. uh, like an actual a, house? A trading company. Trading company. Trading company. They trade uh, like uh, ulong tea or rice or sugar cane or wood with mm. China. That's their office. Maybe they can live upstairs. Some steps. Live upstairs. This is the whole block? Yeah. That's big. Look at this. Here's an exhibition to show what kind of uh, shops near this area. Shoot. Are they for sale or are they just for show? Here is a girl by the elderly people in the nursing house. So we are now on our way Why did they build this? Just to commemorate your president? Yeah. Mm. Just like Lincoln Memorial. Okay. It is so big. Right now, there's like a garden there. It's like a mini garden there. No, not a mini. An actual garden. On both sides. 
he was also uh, the only five-star general in Asia till now because he won the World War II. Are those? 89. 89 steps. Because uh, when he died, he was 89 years old. Oh, so it was really planned out. Yeah. We are getting some souvenirs. from the top back inside to watch the changing of the guards. Perfect time. It's in about five minutes.
And that ends our layover tour in Taipei. I hope you enjoyed this vlog and we'll see you in the next ones, which will be in the Philippines. Bye!